Hello, this is Katie. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if it's your first time. Um, I went to Michael's yesterday um, and picked up a few things. This one is very big, which is why I don't really have anywhere else to put it. So I'm going to show it to you. Uh, I did get another of my card stock that I use for cards. Um, I didn't need it, but I had a 40% off of one item coupon and my fun item at the end that I will show you, it wouldn't have worked on. I guess it didn't. Um, I'm not sure why. It probably didn't include that type of item, I guess. Uh, but this is the card stock that I use for card bases, coloring. So if you were ever wondering, it's just the 110 pound white from Recollections slash Michaels. Um, it's not like white white. I'm sure it's some sort of like off white because even compared to this white, it's less white, like more eggshell white. Um, so there is that. And then this one I just got for fun. I wanted to use it this weekend. It's 12 by 18. Uh, the same watercolor pads that I always buy, which I will be showing you as well. So I'm gonna get my bag emptied. So I always uh, grab at least one. This time I grab two. Every time I go to Michael's, just because I kind of use this just for doodling. Um, and to get any ideas out. And I also use it to paint on. But uh, so this is the 140 pound cold press, the six by nine, uh, but it's the same paper, but 12 by 18. And I just thought it would be super fun to, they have some information in here. I'm not really sure. Oh, for use with, so the type of paper and what you can use on the paper, that's a good chart oops, to have. Um, but I just thought it'd be really fun to paint something ginormous. Um, yeah, it's the same, their same sample picture, just bigger. Uh, so I got this big one. I got two of these, not from Michael's, just to show you, I got, um, two sets from Kindred Stamps. This one, uh, because me and my husband have been watching news bloopers on YouTube, uh, like regularly and it's really funny and there's one that I found the lady and I want to make her a card about her blooper because it was really funny like she posted it on her own YouTube channel and um, so I wanted to use one of these to make her a card and it's also kind of like Halloween themed so I thought it would be kind of fun to uh, make that and then send it to her so that's really why I got this set but maybe I could make some other news bloopers as well uh, and then this one, of course, for Mrs. Doubtfire. I thought that was super cute. So those I just got recently, obviously not from Michael's. I got those from Kindred Stamps. Um, I picked up a new pen really just for work. I tested it out on their test paper and ended up really liking it. Um, it's a 0.5 which is more my preference, but it wrote really well. And then I have this one in the lighter teal, but I wanted the darker teal. This is also for work. It's just kind of to make my to-do lists a little more exciting and fun to write. Um, I'm gonna leave this here because it's huge and I don't wanna have to find another spot for it in a second until I show you my final item. Um, then in the uh, ink kind of watercolor area, is uh, this, and I can use it with the fountain pen that I got. I'm trying not to stab myself in the process because I put it in my stand-up thing with all my paint brushes. But with this fountain pen, it's been really fun to sketch. I'm not doing any calligraphy of any sort um, to sketch stuff and then paint. So once this is dry, it's waterproof. And so I got teal. Uh, well, there was a teal, but it was more blue. This one's called aqua, which is more teal to me, but whatever. Um, and I thought that would be fun to sketch and then paint over that color. And then I was going to get something on Amazon, but I saw these. And on Amazon, they didn't have packs of two. They had packs of way too many. And so I got glass jar because I need to switch. I'm not going to take this out because I will spill it on myself again. This black ink, it's waterproof ink that I also use for sketching, just like with my pen and the other one. Um, 
but the seal is not great. So I tilted it just the littlest bit and it like leaked. So I'm hoping to transfer it into one of these and I'm hoping this jar is better. Uh, and then I can actually like see through it when I dip into it. So I pick that up as well. So I'm gonna move these out of the way and then I'm gonna bring in the more exciting item. Okay, so the last thing I picked up is this, but it's not the one that Michaels used to have. And the first thing I noticed was this little side metal thing, which the other one has. I have an old one from like, I think Recollections, I can't remember the brand, but the carousel that Michaels always had. I noticed this was blue. I can't tell if you can tell, but anyway, I was like weird. And then I noticed the brand and it's their new Simply Tidy brand. And I had showed you guys this embellishment box before in another haul. And um, I'm not sure where, oops, that was my paper falling over. Um, I'm not sure where it ended up, but I felt so silly my husband was watching my video and he's like, cause I was like, oh, it's called or Ordonia's or something or Ordonna's, that's a cool name. Like their new storage brand, Michael's has switched over apparently from whatever it was before. And he's like, no, I think like that's Spanish for Simply Tidy. Cause they it said Simply Tidy and then it said it right below it. It said Ordonna's or Simplement. And I think it's French or Spanish. I'm not even sure if we verified which it was anyway. Um, so it's very similar. I think it's bigger. I'm going to show you very quickly. I'm going to shut off one of these lights cause it's very bright and then bring you down here and show you. So I have the old carousel and my ring light that I just turned off. Um, and that I need to switch it over, but it sits in the corner perfectly. So it's, uh, I hope it's not, I hope this one's not too wide so it can still spin a little bit. Um, but I've cleaned that one out once and it's just getting old. So I figured I would switch it over. It doesn't have a photo pocket like the old one. Um, the old one has a photo pocket in the side and it has a picture of me and my husband at my, my best friend's wedding. Um, but it doesn't, this new one doesn't have one, so I'll have to put that photo somewhere else. But anyway, so there's that. Um, I don't, it's not spinning on its carousel because it's all wrapped right now. But I will open that up and transfer it over. Um, so that was all that I picked up. I wanted to ask you guys a favor. Um, I have a new crafty friend and she wants to grow her YouTube channel. So I thought I would help a little bit and use my video um, to help her out. So her YouTube channel will be the only link in the description of this video. That will be the only thing down there. If you could go there and subscribe to her, if you like what you see, I'm sure you will if you like card making. Um, and help her get to 500 is her current goal. I think she's maybe six or seven away from that. If you could help her get to her goal, that would make me very happy. And that's it. Um, yeah, uh, I will see you guys next time and thank you for watching. Bye.